Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll be looking at the biggest differences between monetary and fiscal policy. With that said, let's get into it. So when looking at policy, there's two main types that we talk about. We talk about fiscal policy and monetary policy, and there's five main differences between them that we're going to be highlighting in this video very briefly. Firstly, for fiscal policy, it's controlled by the government. So these are governmental decisions and monetary policy is actually controlled by the central bank. So depending on which nation you're in, that may be a different party, but in Canada, that's the Bank of Canada in the United States, it's the Federal Reserve and so on and so forth. Each country has a related central bank and that central bank implements monetary policy, whereas their government implements fiscal policy. The second big difference is that fiscal policy takes place by changing taxation and government spending, whereas monetary policy takes place by changing the interest rate. So the key drivers in these two policies are very different things. Again, one taxation and government spending is controlled by the government and the interest rate is set by the central bank. The third difference is that the main goals of fiscal policy are full employment and economic growth, while the main goals of monetary policy is to manage inflation. Once again, you might notice a trend, full employment and economic growth are very government heavy goals and managing inflation is the biggest cause for changing the interest rate in the first place. So a very central bank oriented goal as well. The fourth difference is that fiscal policy looks at the supply side and monetary policy looks at the demand side of an economy. So on the supply side, think of investment and production and on the demand side, think of consumption and retail investment. So finally, this last one, which is pretty intuitive, is that fiscal policy inevitably takes longer and that monetary policy is just faster to implement. And, and the reason for this, once again, is primarily due to who runs the show. The government runs the show for fiscal policy and that takes legislation and lots of red tape to get through versus monetary policy, which is done by the central bank, is pretty immediate. When that overnight interest rate changes, the banks and other financial institutions react very quickly and then that very quickly gets reflected to the general public and it hits its goals much faster. Now, sometimes fiscal policy and monetary policy work together and sometimes they actually conflict one another and we'll talk about that in a different video. In this video, we just wanna highlight the five main differences between them. If you found this video helpful, let us know by liking the video, subscribing to the channel, of course, let us know in the comments section what sort of economic topics or homework questions you'd like to see us cover in the future. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll catch you in the next.